are underway from Dodger Stadium as the first pitch is taken here for ball one. 1 0 count here it is. Little flare out to left and a base hit so the leadoff man is on to begin the inning. He'll get it into second and he's out trying to stretch it into a double so a costly mistake here leading off the inning. Right fielder Andrew McCutcheon. First delivery to him on the way. And this will be fouled away. A great day and a great night here for game two. 69 degrees, our temperature at first pitch. And a slow curveball in there for strike two. So let's take a peek at the umpiring crew working this one. Behind the plate is Eric Summersgill. Summersgill is a little notorious for having a wide zone. Really frustrated for hitters. I saw one guy turn around at him one day and yell, is this a picnic table or is it a plate? Yeah, he was tossed before he finished the sentence. And the off-balance throw beats him oh, at first, and that's nine. a tough play. Ted Williams. Digging in, Ted Williams. First chance for him here in the top of the first with nobody on. First pitch fastball off the plate there, and it's ball one. Bases are empty here with two men out. That one's going to find the seats. Strike one. A swing and a drive sent out toward the gap. Back goes Puig at the track. Gone! Solo shot to right center. His first homer so far in the series. As the Braves get on the board first, it's one to nothing. That's one of those pitches you wish you could take back as soon as it leaves your hand. But guess what? There are no delete or rewind buttons in baseball. That's a mistake, and it was a good job by his opponent to make him pay for it. Into the box, Eddie four. Murray. The first baseman, number 33, Eddie and Murray. And so take a look at ball one. Matt, I can't get past the last at bat. I mean, to, to drive in a run and get you on the board first, that is huge. Now the rest of the lineup can relax and swing the bat. Pitch to the plate is a slider for a strike, and it's all knotted up at one and one. And he's keeping it down here, and that's a cold strike, too. Here we are in the first inning. We're watching adjustments be made. After giving up that extra base hit, now that's better location. He's going to have a better day if he does that. Two out, nobody on. Waved at and missed for the third out. Not much of a chance at hitting that one, and the inning is over. But the Braves are on the board first, thanks to the solo home run. Bottom of the first coming up, and the Braves have an early 1-0 advantage. Time now to check out how the hometown Dodgers line up in this one. What's this club need to focus on this evening, H? Well, Matt, they find themselves already down one. The big thing here, realize you got a lot of game left. Just score one run. Try to get right back in the game, even it up, and play the whole nine innings. You can't just play part of the game, play the whole game. Julio Tehran is on the mound for game two. What do we need to know here, HR? Well, Matt, he's got five pitches, and I mean, they're all good. He throws them for strikes. He dominates. He mixes speeds up. I asked him one day, what's your best pitch? And he told me, all five. All right, here's how the Braves line up defensively, brought to you by Majestic. And in the outfield, Ender Enciarte. I love how this guy can go get the ball. He seems to have a real good knowledge. And one thing I've watched a lot, he'll cut the ball off and get it back in to keep that double play in order. Very valuable player. Here's Paul Goldschmidt now. He'll lead things off here in the bottom half of the Leading first. Off for the Dodgers. First baseman, Paul Goldschmidt.
lifted out towards straightaway center field. And Ciarte is there, and he hauls it in for the first out of the inning. Batting second, center fielder, Jock Peterson. Solo shot here to straightaway right field. His second home run of the series. And the Dodgers are back even now at one apiece. Well, I'm excited to check the home run numbers that come out on show track because that was just one of the most impressive launches we've seen in a good while. And as the numbers come in, that ball was projected to have carried over 460 feet. An amazing show of strength. Batting third, the shortstop, Manny Machado. into the windup and the pitch swing and that's hit out of play up into the plaza level well he saw that ball pretty good too bad he couldn't keep it fair and he swings on top of one here and chops it foul right at home plate the windup and the 0-2 pitch swing and a ball lifted in the air toward the line and right McCutcheon is under it and he brings it in for the second out of the inning. Batting fourth, third baseman, Justin Turner. First pitch coming, here it is. Hit hard on the ground towards second, and stretching for it is Kinsler, but it's out of reach, a base hit. Didn't waste any time, like the first pitch he saw to keep the inning going. That's what you call going to the play with a game bet. plan. Oh, oh, count, count looking for a fastball, it took it Reiner. right back up the middle. Great execution. In now, Ralph Kiner. Now a shot to center field. Back goes the center fielder, but this ball has plenty behind it, and it's a home run. Two run shot to straightaway center, his second home run of the series, and it gives the Dodgers a three to one lead. Well, it's very early, but he's looked out of sorts from the beginning. They've already roughed him up for two homers, and they're not done yet. We'll see if he can regroup or he blows up. Could go either way at this point. And now is Yasiel Puig. Right He'll go after the first pitch and bounce it into foul territory. Pitch swung on and hit in the air. Inciarte on the run. And that ends the inning. So two home runs in the inning lead to three runs on the scoreboard. On to the second now at Dodger Stadium. It's the Dodgers three and the Braves one.